Welcome back to the channel um, I was going to do a video today on redoing all the rub strips on the car so the rub strips have gone oh shit they've lost all their all their color all the paint's coming off them and they just look tacky and crap uh, but I ended up getting a delivery from white line in the post uh, nice new hat New flex fit hat, white line. Um, I signed up to be an ambassador for them. They had a, a thing going on Instagram, I seen it and signed up. So I got the ambassador's pack, get the hat, got a pair of gloves for working, get stickers, big stickers to put on the car, a few different sizes, 500, 350 200 little ones and a few bits and pieces Um, you got a few biros stay you got a few biros and key rings and more stickers than that another sheet of stickers this is the the program what i signed up for uh you get a discount on that and you just have to plug them give them an old plug so I ended up picking up the shift linkages, the mounts for it. My ones are flogged out. And sway bar bushes. Because, yeah, you always need them. And, yeah, I think I'm going to go and fit these instead today. So, uh, yeah, we'll get into it. See how we go. So this is the main bush that we're going changing. This holds the linkage sturdy at the end. Push your linkage through here, bolts up to the body. Uh, it's just a stronger bushing, polyurethane bushing. So it's gonna go in under here, now up, and it's up the top up there so we'll drop the linkage down out of it probably drop the exhaust off the hangers drop the linkage down take that piece out and see how we look see what we're up against I'll get back to them a few when I have it down and see what sort of wear is on that one and compare them So, gear linkage is out. End up pulling the whole lot out because it was too hard to drop the exhaust. So, pull the whole lot out. When we're pulling it, putting it together, this is where we split and join them. These are the linkages out of the DC2 that all the engine and suspension and everything came out of. So, we ended up cutting, I think it was about 20 mil out of here. We just shortened them on both. Both of them were the same. Could probably take another another five mil out of it because the gear lever is still a bit forward. So yeah, but this is where we're at here. So this one comes off, and this is the bush we're going changing. So yeah, it doesn't look bad. It's pretty soft though compared to the other one. Like it's it's fairly flexy. So yeah, can't see it making much of a difference, but. Yeah, we got them, so we might as well put them into it. Alright, so got it all back in. Got everything tightened up. There was a couple of little nuts loose on the actual linkage mechanism where the gear stick comes up through. So I've tightened all that up. And I can already tell, without the car even been down, that it's... A lot tighter than it was before because no extra slap on it it's it's beautiful it's perfect so yeah mission success um didn't take near as long as i thought it did probably spent about 20 minutes 25 minutes doing it got black dirty because uh yeah, the underneath of this thing is pretty manky. Pulling the engine in a few more weeks. So when it's up on stands, I'm going to power wash the hole underneath of it. Get it all clean because it's just 
cake there's fucking inches shit stuck to the underneath of it so uh yeah big shout out to white line again for hooking up with the bits and the hats and bits and pieces need the hat in the worst way anyway but yeah So there's one thing that I hate about cars, Hondas, is the rear wiper. There's no need for the back window. You don't need to see where you've been. You don't need to see where you're going. So I'm gonna go and pull all the wiper out of it and all the mechanism. Rams are tight. So we're gonna get in here and pop this off. Um, it looks like there's only one clip left in it. Yeah. Yeah, I've only got one clip. This is going to be handy enough. So, we'll pull the back wiper out of it. I've got bungs to put into it to block it to stop the water coming in, so... Well, uh, yeah. Yeah, I get a screwdriver to start popping this shit off. So, got the plastics off. They're all off. The boot lid's a lot cleaner looking than I thought. There's no rust in it anywhere up there, so. No up in around there. She's all schmick. Um, so, next now, there's these three 12 mils and the little wire harness. So, we'll. Uh, just unplug this can somehow. Yeah, I'll have to get a fucking screwdriver in to pop that. And then I need to lift that. Take that off, take that big nut off, take all that shit out. And yeah, we should be laughing. It should be the end of the rear wiper. And there we have it. Wiper removed. Wire tucked and all. So, uh, this little black grommet, rubber grommet into it. Need to clean the oily hand points off it now. But yeah, it was less about weight reduction and more about aesthetics, really. But the motor does have a bit of weight to it, so yeah, don't need it. Much better look. Yeah, much better. Clean. Yeah, I suppose now I may put a, a couple of these white line stickers on. Where'd I go though? I might do a couple more under the banner. It's getting a bit bare. Let's see what's in the kit. So, a couple of little stickers. Little, little ones. Go one under the bonnet. One in the wheel well. And then a matching one this side. Only very small. Little touches. But yeah, again, big shout out to White Line. Um, yeah, very happy with the with the bits and pieces. I'll probably get the sway bar bushes in the next one. These ones, two, four, six, eight, four side. So yeah, that's pretty simple, pretty straightforward job. Wheel off, two 12 mil nuts, and yeah, pop them out, pop in the new bushes. See how it goes. Should be pretty good. Very happy with how the gear linkage feels at the minute. 
and yeah yeah quite for the leaf as well it's been looking sweet car needs a clean she's getting all dusty get rid of these oily handprints now everything got dusty last night with a dust storm along with a rainstorm I only washed this the other day looking nightmare anyway thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to like comment subscribe whatever all that other shit and see you next time peace